Hi everybody, it's your old pal Chuck, and I'm back once again for one of my quick and dirty bedroom reviews. Today we're going to be taking a look at, from the Pursuit of Cobra line, it is the G.I. Joe Cobra Shock Trooper. This was a new trooper created for the line, and let me just say, he is hella sweet. Let's just start off with the packaging real quick, because... As you can see, some of the accessories are missing, because I have them with the figure, but there's a ton more in here. By my estimations, you can may have up to three uniquely different um, shock troopers. They have electrocuted batons, taser, salt rifle, shotgun, and a sledgehammer. We'll go into the other accessories with the figures. And there they are. With what I just mentioned, they also have... A Cobra uh, shield, like a riot shield, a small automatic weapon uh, helmet with goggles, and a gas mask. Let me just come in here so I can show you. To put the gas mask on, you basically have to put it over the trooper's face, then put the helmet on. And the goggles can stay on rather nicely with... Um, the helmet. There's little notches there. There's also come with a walkie-talkie that has a place on the back here. If I can show it to you. Right under the Cobra logo. There's also a little holding bar. Uh, we found out during the course of the line that these holding bars are actually used by military to drag people out. As I mentioned in the Alley Viper review, um... He actually has a unique gripping mechanism for the shield. As you can see, it loops around his arm and then goes into the hand. Usually what I do is I bend the wrist backwards so it will slide into the hand. Yes, since this does use um, Pursuit of Cobra Snake Eyes tooling, they do have the new wrist articulation. These th guys are badass. I mean, there's just no way to say it. To me, these are the best Cobra Troopers I have ever seen. Um, here he is holding that uh, assault rifle. Holds it perfectly with the wrist articulation. There's the head sculpt. Um, I just, I can't get over it. I mean, these guys, I've had them for a while, I mean, but these guys are incredible. In my opinion, these, these should have just been the Pursuit of Cobra Troopers. And not and just called Cobra Troopers instead of the Shock Troopers, because and then skip over releasing the Cobra Trooper later on. I mean that's a cool figure too, but I mean these guys just blow it out of the water with the accessories. You know, literally, like I said, three different versions of the figure, if not more, depending on how you do it. There was some confusion as to what exactly a Shock Trooper's function is in Cobra. Myself and Greg, the former co-host of What's on Joe Mind with me, um, we decided that these guys are, ba are the f first guys in. They basically are the ones who break down the door, secure the area, and then the alley vipers come in and do what they have to. But these can also be generic troopers. Having these guys, I really regretted not getting the Cobra Rage, which goes for a pretty penny now on eBay and Amazon. And it was just one of those things. But if you see these guys, and let me tell you, they were hard to find in the first place. I was lucky I got two. Pick them up. There is some Pursuit of Cobra figures still on shelves now. So if you see them, grab them. That's all I can tell you. This is your old pal Chuck, and I'll see you next time.